While I was at college, I, uh, my teacher sort of sat me down and said, oh, so I know that you were really, really interested in doing law, you know, because I've always wanted to do it since I was like 15, ever since I started watching Suits, actually. <laughs> um, and he said to me, I've heard about a course called Pathways to Law, and it gives you a chance to network with the university and various sort of legal personnel. Um, so I thought, yeah, that sounds great. How do you do it? So he said, you have to apply for it online. So he gave me the website, I applied for it, and th that was pretty much it. The ball started rolling from there. Quite often, um, when I was telling people that I wanted to do law in the future, the reaction was, <gasps> like, oh no. And it was a bit sort of like, that's a brave thing to do. So sometimes it feels like it's not for you, it's for a particular group of people. And so it was really nice to find something that was going to try and celebrate me and people like me and get us into the programme and get us into law. So that was really nice. It gave me a chance to get work experience. So I had work experience at a company called Freets in Nottingham and that was for a week and it was in private litigation and it was amazing. I loved it. Well, I think one of the most important things that I took away from it was my knowledge of the city. I think when you first come to Nottingham or any city where you, that you don't really know, it's quite scary. You don't really know what to expect. Um, but because I've been coming here for two years doing Pathways, I was like, OK, I know campus. And also, uh, through Pathways to Law, I've been doing mentoring. And um, I've been trying to encourage my mentees to go on open days. And they're often like, what's the value out of it? And I say, even if you just go, and walk on the campus, you get a feel for the place. There's nothing like being on campus. Um, so it's really nice just to get a feel for Nottingham. It's really nice just to feel what it's like, just to even walk along the street, what the atmosphere's like, really. I think it gave me a bit of a head start to all the other students. And I think because I've always been very much the kind of person that loves to be at home, it helped me in the process of moving out. I, th I thought it was great, and I'm not just saying that. I thought it was great. I met some really amazing people. I met people from Oxford, I met people from Mansfield, I met people from Lincoln, all over the place, and uh, I made some really good friends out of it. Uh, I think it also gives you a good confidence boost, because as I said, when I did work experience, it was the first time I'd ever been in a room with other solicitors in their in the building that they work in. It was very daunting when I first got there, but by the end of the week I was walking in with people on first name basis. I rang them up afterwards, asked them for further work experience, and they actually granted it, and it was just great. I found it very helpful regarding my personal statement, um, because I think sometimes when you're in school, the teachers sort of go, right, write a personal statement and then you go, I don't know where to start. Um, but I know I had a lot of content in there that I drew on from my Pathways to Law experience. So whether it was the, um, the commercial day or whether it was my work experience, a lot of that went into my personal statement. So I found that really, really helpful. In relation to Pathways, have helped me while at university to enhance my confidence, to help me gain some networking with other lawyers and that kind of thing. I really enjoyed the forensics day. I thought that was really different. I think when law is portrayed to you, it's not very often you think about things like forensics. And so it was nice because in the midst of doing all of the, um, like we did a negotiation day and we did a, like a criminal day. So it was really nice to have a forensics day in there as well, something that was a bit different. And I, I really feel like I opened my mind a bit more after that. I really enjoyed the mooting day because I'd never even knew what a moot was. Like, a random person on the street, if you said, oh, I did a moot, they'd be like, what? Like, my mum didn't have a clue. But when you actually do it and you see what it entails, I thought, you know what, this is something I'd love to do. And it was sort of, it spurred me to consider being a barrister, perhaps, rather than a solicitor. And doing this moot for the first time almost told me, do you know what, yeah, this is something I could do for my life. And that's why I, I loved it so much. I 
think you just have to apply. You have to take all of this idea out of your head that it's not possible, that um, law isn't for your group of people, and you need to apply, and you need to put yourself out there because there's nothing better than the feeling of having somebody on your side. I think that's the thing from Pathways to Law with me, is that I actually feel like somebody's behind me saying, you can do this and we believe in you and we're going to give you every opportunity we can to help you do well. So apply and get in there and get going.